we had to learn how to let go of our ego and really consider everything that we do and the work that we produce as a shared pursuit. I'm Michael, I was born in the Netherlands and I grew up in Germany. Uh, my parents are from China, uh, from a city called Wenzhou, uh, which is in the Zhejiang province of China. I'm Qian, uh, I was born in the UK. I grew up between London and Hong Kong. I'm Malaysian Chinese and I'm Hokkien, meaning I'm from the province of Fujian. Growing up, we've always tried to navigate two different cultures and so we oftentimes feel we belong to neither, but rather sit sort of in the in-between space. And this is something that we try to explore within our paintings. So in-between is liminality and we often use our work to reconnect to our Chinese cultural heritage. We graduated uh, from architecture school three years ago now um, and we kind of took a leap of faith and um, sort of decided not to go down the architecture route but rather to pursue an art practice. Architecture tends to um, propose a solution to something whereas I think in the, particularly in our world we are allowed to sort of pose questions so I think that was something that we particularly had an affinity to. I would say that our collaboration is purely a, almost a, a verbal one. By that I mean we don't necessarily have four hands on the canvas at any time um, and so often also some paintings are purely done by one or the other. Um, so in that sense uh, where we find collaboration is really about talking, ide talking about ideas. As an artist it's a very lonely profession so having another person besides you in the studio is very helpful. The way we paint is basically from the back to front. It's a very uh, physical process where we layer and push the paint through from the back. And once it has composed an image, we unstretch it and flip it and stretch it again so that the back becomes the front. So because of our technique, we've built this structure in order to hang the paintings so that the back is free. And so often we'll paint and we'll have to just run around the back to see what's happened and see what surprise is waiting for us on the other side. We want to create this in-between space where you don't know where the space ends or begins. In this residency, it was the first time we are exploring uh, larger scale work, so the largest painting being almost 3.5 by 2 meters. So yeah, it's been really exciting to work on a new scale which allowed us to compose more complex and new narratives.